Hello, my going viewers. We are back. And we now have to turn in some quests. Joy. I've decided not to do the heroic for this mission. Because I'll be getting to a speeder later. I can just do, go there. Welcome back, my illustrious colleague. Hello. Tell me you've taken the seismic readings. I managed the job. It was rough, but I pulled it off. Fantastic. I tell you, we're going to make history together. Quickly, please, let me examine the Burma seismic activity reader. All right, here you go. What? It can't be. This indicates there is no unusual seismic activity at all. Sorry, but it's true. It seems your theory proved to be incorrect. I just can't believe it. I haven't been wrong in so long. This could reflect very poorly on my reputation. I suggest you take your compensation and keep quiet. I believe the reward is generous given the outcome. Now, if you'll excuse <laughs> me, I have much to consider. Farewell. Being wrong once in a while is not that bad. It just shows you're human. Um. Okay, that was a weird lag spike. <laughs> but yeah, I hope everyone's having a great day today. I still love this suit. How it, how the war suit looks so good. It matches so well. Still wish I had rocket boots or a speeder, but you can't have them all, I guess. I think it's a legacy thing. Surprise! Oh. Hope that person does okay. Welcome. Please select an available travel route. Okay, so I can either turn in the quest or do the heroic. I'll do the heroic. I'll see you guys when I get there. And here we are, Jedi Temple speeder pad. Quite the Jedi Temple, more industrial. Very industrial. Who would build a Jedi Temple here, seriously? These carrier drives have been through heck and back. Oh, that's another quest. Looks like inside the door. Ah, come on. Let's see what this quest is. Open up. Huh. Thanks, stranger. Didn't think anyone else was fool enough to wander this pile of rubble. You'd be surprised. Stupid move, trusting some prig senator. Jedi temples abandoned, he says. No one to fight, only troubles getting there. What do we find? Battle droids, Imperial commandos, Sith. Lucky all they did was take our hall and lock us in here to die. Why are they here? Do you know what the Imperials are trying to do? Besides attack mercs on a legit job? No idea. Senator Stars knows after a journal that belonged to his dead kid. Some bigwig Jedi fell during huh. the sacking. The journal's all that's left of him. I feel for the Senator and his credits, but those commandos have the journal now. 
They aren't gonna spare us twice. I'll give that journal. The senator deserves it more than the empire. Suit yourself, soldier. The journal will be mine. It's your job, not mine. Senator Star Snow's waiting near the Senate Tower. If you can get that journal back, he'll be expecting you. Thanks for the rescue. Come on, boys. This job's a bust. All right. So now I have two quests to do here. That means double the XP. So now I have to look for a journal. Okay, there's the heroic. I'll do that. Knock, knock, boys! All right. Put on my shields, hit him. Jorgen, where's the heels? Oh, by the way, did I forget to mention that in Heroics, normal enemies are a little bit tougher than usual? I'm still here in the... The announcements. It's a coward strategy, but it's working until everything else loads up. There we go. Now you. Whoo. Recharge and reload. Take this. Ah, bugger. I'm doing pretty good. This guy's too le a level above me, and I'm doing good. Data library. I don't care why you did this, but I'm glad it's done. I owe you one. So take these credits. The Republic honors its debts. Uh, let's get rid of that. Oh, nice. 
You better enjoy it, Jorgen. So if you don't, I'm gonna slap you. Oh no. Sorry everyone, had a little accident with the computer. <laughs> For those who don't know, I have a little monitor next to my computer letting me know if the internet is going to have a, tr a trouble spot or not or if it needs to be rebooted. It just needs to be rebooted for a sec, so. Apologize for the, no for the extra clip. Alright, let's go get this. Uh... Is that another. No. You don't think. What is this place? Oh, okay, this is for the Jedi people. I'm not supposed to be in here. This is for when you want to make your own lightsaber. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I don't know why I was I was allowed to go in there. I genuinely have no idea why I was allowed in there. Farov. Farov. This should be a good group to start with. One, two. Oh, you're at still full health. I said apprentice. Let me go. Where's Jorgen? Where is he? He's healing me, but... Where the devil did he go? Did he go into the floor? There he is! There's Jorgen! Jordan, you idiot. <laughs> Give me the journal. Give me the journal. You idiot. He didn't give me the journal. He was an idiot. Anything? Nope. Okay, it's gotta be these two. Come 
Come on, come on, come on, gold. Yes! Now I can t travel to the Senate Tower. There we go, people. I think that was pretty quick. Ah, dang it. One second, everyone. And we are back. Got to turn in this quest and get the new one. And then I'm going to go to the upstairs, clip to that. Because go because without the without the speeder or rocket boost, it's gonna take me a while. The power darkness is obsolete. The conduits are fully functional, and I have witnessed through our monitors. Also, you destroyed many enemy droid machines. So well done. That was great, and we're so is it all over? Coruscant's power supply is safe. No more blackouts. Now, not eternally. I won't live that long. Oh, looks like that might be all of it. Came, saw, destroyed. Eventually, yes. <laughs> it was rough, but I pulled it off. The Enclave delivers its promised Gree ingenuity, Senator. Coruscant acquires purple equilateral, and the Enclave requests Republic reciprocity. Ambassador Droid Patake, the Republic has other damaged worlds that could benefit from your Gree ingenuity. I propose drafting a formal treaty between the Republic and the Gree Enclave. What do you say to that? You seek a blue parallel with the Enclave. I am astonished, gratified, challenged by the prospect. Let us initiate renewed white vertex at once. That's my cue to exit. Time for this soldier to get back to his war. Cultivate carefulness, Black Bisector. Tread toward Orange Acute, and you will conclude life cycle fulfilled. You have my thanks for all your efforts. I'd almost given up on these droids before you came along. That would have been a costly mistake. Acknowledgement and profound tribute, Black Bisector. This collaboration achieves through you. Hmm. Well, I finished that. I want the XP boost. I need that. New code entry, Black Bisector. Okay, everyone, one sec while I clip real fast. And I have arrived. Senator Starsnow. Yeah. None of the mercenaries never returned. The Empire couldn't be after family heirlooms. I must inform the Senate of this. Do. Thank you, Lieutenant. And be careful. If the Empire's on Coruscant, we may need our soldiers soon. They're on Coruscant already. They've been on Coruscant. I've been ripping them a new one ever since. Yeet! Garza? Let's talk advancement. <laughs> Just doing my job. Jack Carden walked up to the Senate's tower's front door and surrendered himself in broad daylight. I never thought I'd see the day. Carden's help will give us quite an edge against Tavis and the others. I'm glad you could change his mind. Where is he now? Do we have Carden in a secure location? Shortly. First, we'll make sure he doesn't have any tricks up his sleeves. I haven't come this far by taking chances. The Justicar's computer files included messages relayed between four locations. 
Our technicians are working to pinpoint those locations now. There can be no doubt that the messages will lead us to the other traders. Hmm. Thanks to your efforts, we'll be able to bring them all to justice very soon. What happens until then? What are my orders in the meantime? As it happens, we've already discovered the location of one of the Havoc traders, Wraith. You remember Senator uh -oh. Kressel from your meeting with the Senate earlier? Yeah. Wraith kidnapped him from his home just afterward. We've tracked them to a remote space station called Port Raga. What is she planning? Has Wraith made any demands? What's her objective? Our intelligence is very thin at the moment. No demands have been made as yet. One of our teams is already en route to Port Raga. They'll investigate the situation and give you a detailed report on arrival. You've accomplished some amazing things, Lieutenant. Yep. But there's no time for a break yet. Whatever Wraith is planning, we cannot allow her to succeed. You can count on me, General. I won't rest until the job is done. I know you won't, Lieutenant. Havoc Squad requires its own starship for operational flexibility. Our ship has already been transferred to your command. I appreciate it's it, General. At the spaceport now. Thank you very much. Put it to good use, Lieutenant. Fly to Port Raga and meet with the advance team immediately. Your orders are to rescue Senator Krasul and capture or eliminate Wraith at all costs. I'm going to capture luck, her. Lieutenant. Dismissed. Let's get out there and take down some traitors. Death would be too much. Death would be too much. You know what? Inventory's full. I now have an extra ship. Go sell, go sell my trash items, yes, Jorgen. Okay, I'll be right back when I get back to the... When I get to the ship. Or the strong... You know what? I'm going to clip till I get to the stronghold thing, because... I want to do that real fast. All right, here we are. The place where we get the stronghold. Free cheap. I'll buy it. There should be no repercussions. My own house in a game. Who would have thought? There's my house. Now I have a place to live. And now I have to do is just buy another one for, for weapons and strategic weaponry. For war. All right. Speedy stronghold. <laughs> ah. How much room do I have? Not enough. Legacy Stronghold Box. I need that. I can always come back later after I get to my ship. Come pick me up. Oh, that plays the cinematic. I thought it was the terminal. Um, F6 to Coruscant. Return to Coruscant. I have new mail. And I cannot check it because I do not have a mailbox yet.
Oh, good lord. Now I'll clip to where and I get to the to the starship. One moment, everyone. And we have arrived. Trooper phase. We're about to get our own ship, people. Might want to go casual for this. There we go. Casual. There's my ship. My ship. Looks like it has a big mouth. <laughs> I'll name her the Thunderclap. Because fun fact, that's what her name is. To the ship. To the ship. To the ship, 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 ship. To the ship. To the ship. By the way, I've, le I've leveled up to 19 because I was able to find some space in my inventory. It's gonna be a pain having to level her level her armor up, but besides that, I'm fine with it. I can just use my personal characters characters to buy the armor and the stuff I need to get it. Easy peasy. Just gonna clip this so you guys aren't waiting at a title screen. There we go. Well, hello, droid C2N2. My new master at last. I am C2N2, steward of this vessel. It is my extreme good fortune to serve you. I expected a combat unit. Pleased to meet you. Glad to have you aboard. Tell me your function, C2. C2 series droids represent the latest advances in everything from starship technical maintenance to nutritional advice tailored for your specific organic needs. Welcome aboard the Rendili Hyperworks BT-7 Thunderclap, hmm. a rapid assault craft designed especially for Republic Special Forces at enormous taxpayer expense. So the taxpayers are paying for this. accommodations, you'll find a secure captain's locker for storing valuables. I have two mail now. Your bridge contains an ever updating map of the galaxy. It's quite beautiful to look at. Priority alerts from the Republic Network are accessible at the Holonet console. That used to be where the uh, different thing was. Communications are available via the Holo terminal. And finally, the ship's intercom will inform your crew that you wish to meet. Do you have any questions, Master? Can you fight? Sounds like you're good at everything. Does that include combat? As you can see, I am not equipped for physical danger. My function is to maintain the starship as your home away from home. I am happy to assist you with any non-hazardous task, of course. I pride myself on the utmost attention to detail. I could equip you for combat. Hmm. Add a little armor, some combat protocols, and a blaster, and you just might be worth something. Master, please. Any non-factory modification will void my warranty. Whenever you are ready to depart, hmm. consult the galaxy map on the bridge. The ship's computers will handle the rest. All right. Here we go. Hollow terminal. Calling Coruscant Spaceport Authority. Request permission to depart. You are clear for departure. Have a pleasant flight. Woo! Okay, so which one's better? Tech power. Just gonna equip that. All right, Jorgen. 
What do you have to say? I reviewed your service record before that ZR-57 op. Been meaning to discuss it with you. It says you served in the Outer Rim. Knew a lot of good men who fought out there. Heard it was brutal. Warfare like that can change a person. Yeah. Make them reckless. Unstable. You were snooping on me? I can handle myself. You saw how I handled things on Ord Mantel. I know what I'm doing. Taking on that Sep army single-handedly showed guts, not leadership. When I signed on with the Dead Eyes, my CO was Lieutenant Vorn. Certified war hero, as decorated as they come. When he gave an order, we trusted it, followed it to the letter. A squad needs that kind of commitment to operate effectively. What are you implying? You're saying you don't trust me? I'm saying trust requires more than a slick new promotion. Havoc Squad is the Republic's most elite outfit. We tackle the missions no one else can handle. He's not wrong. Traitor or no, Tavis is a tough act to follow. You think you're up to it? I got nothing to prove, you bet. I wouldn't be leading Havoc Squad if I didn't. Hmm. Good answer. You've got confidence and plenty of raw talent. Maybe you'll pull this off. Maybe. Oop, more conversation. I want to get my team to like me and like like the Avengers. We trust each other. We you know each I'm other. Start shaping into an actual squad soon. I like I'll recruit more soldiers as soon as I find some havoc-worthy candidates. Makes yeah. sense. Once this unit starts growing, people's expectations of us, of you, are only going to get bigger. That CO post yep. could get real heavy real quick. I love this job. I'll take that I'll take on that burden. Someone needs to run Havoc Squad. Commanding a squad is no cakewalk. Nothing worse than having to choose between the success of the mission and the lives of your men. A leader's gotta be ready to make those kinds of life or death decisions. There's no room for doubt. That's good advice. You've got a point. I'll keep it in mind. I'm sure you'll do fine. You've gotten us this far. All right. Let's just hope I can rise up to the challenge of being an actual, you know, leader. To Port Raga. I'm about to rip somebody in two. <laughs> Oh, Wraith is gonna meet my mouse. <laughs> if you detect the approval of Alderanian Nectar, Woo! Wraith is going to get what's coming to her. And I'm going to spare her. Not going to kill her. Spare. Oh, Wraith! Jaxo? Well, if it isn't the man himself, I was hoping Garza would send you to handle this one. I'd have preferred getting together somewhere a bit more private than a hostage situation. But this will just have to do. Tell me what you've learned. Give me a sit rep, Sergeant. Let's start with the accommodations. Port Raga is privately owned and officially neutral, but Wraith and her pals have taken over behind the scenes. My boys and I managed to tweak the sensors and keep your landing inconspicuous. But as soon as you step out of this hangar, it's party time. Any intel in the center? Do you know where Cressul is being held? We do. But there's some bad news on that front. Wraith has Cressul locked up in a hangar at the other end of the station. There's heavy security plus a big bonus. Explosives. Not enough bang to trash the station, of course. Oh, but enough to kill them. to ruin your day if you're in that hangar when they blow. Play it careful in there. Thanks for the heads up, Sergeant. You got it. I'd say it's time to get out there and get our Senator back. What do you say? Let's do it. Havoc Squad, move out. It's about time. See you on the other side, Lieutenant. Time to get one. Tick tock, tick tick tock. In the next episode, 
because we are out of time. Hope you all have a great day. Sorry for the cliffhanger. Bye.